yarn to bees. How are you today? Why do I always feel like you're down too low? Anyway. Okay, so I put a post in... Did I put a post on YouTube? I can't remember. But I put one on my Facebook page and said, basically, what do you think I'm making? Well, <laughs> I'm sure that we've all seen it. Um, Taylor Swift was wearing a cover-up dress kind of thing. Um, and it's gone viral, of course. Uh, I've only seen a couple of YouTubers that have been trying to make this dress. Kristen Nomdahl just put out a video uh, explaining her version. There's another girl that put out her version. I'm trying to do this. I'm not doing it in those colors because I honestly, they was aren't the colors that I'm interested in. But <clears throat> I'm attempting to do this. <laughs> I've never done a drop neckline like that in crochet. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I'm kind of flying at the seat of my pants on this. Um, yeah. So I am using Karen Latte and Karen Cloud Cakes. It's extremely soft. It's really nice. So this is what I've got so far. <clears throat> and this is the drop, the drop neck on this side. Okay, now I'm just about to go up on this side. I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna do that. Now let me tip you guys down a little bit. Um, yeah, because I've never, I, going down is easy. Going back up, not so much. So I gotta figure that out. But this is, what it looks like so far. I'm not doing, like I'm just doing four, four, four. Um, I'm not doing like the four, two, four, whatever. Uh, I'm just kind of winging it and just doing what I feel I can handle <laughs> without having to think too much. So yeah, so that's the beginning. Um, I'm really hoping that it's gonna turn out but like I said, I've never done a neckline like this before. Um, so now it's a matter of trying to figure out how to go back up when there's nothing to attach to. I know I have to add like increase um, stitches, but I'm trying to figure out how to do that. Because <laughs> um, if you see this side, I dropped stitches, right? Like I just did a chain and then yeah so anyway yeah it's this that's going to be the hard part for me once i've figured out how to get from here to here oops from here to here then it's easy right um then you just chain however many i guess so yeah i think a lot of people are just doing panels i'm not into doing panels i'm just i want to get it done in one or two pieces and be done with it so hopefully I can figure this out and uh, if I can't then I'm gonna have to make this side panel again and then attach it which I really don't want to do so we'll see how it goes hey yarn to bees okay so you're gonna hear my printer excuse me you're gonna hear my printer burping and farting in the back corner here I'm trying to um, do some maintenance on it because it just <sighs> is trying to fight me. It's having, having a hissy fit right now. So <clears throat> I'm putting it in timeout. <laughs> and I'm trying to maintenance, maintenance, it, it, you know, uh, clean the heads and all that kind of stuff. So you're going to hear a little bit of that for a few minutes. Um, I just wanted to show this to you show you the progress that I've done on this and of course here I was struggling today trying to figure out how I do the collar on this thing <laughs> trying to figure out how to do the collar on this thing and then within hours tutorials started coming out on people's pages and Brianna K I'll leave the link down below she came out with one I'm a bit confused about hers, a little bit. Um, somebody came out with a free pattern. I can't remember who, 
but the, the patterns and the tutorials are coming out all over the place so I'm not going to be doing that because a, a tutorial because yeah there's other people that are far better than me that are doing it so uh, Kristen Omdahl just put out a live where she was showing how to do it so yeah I'm just a peon I'm not I'm not going to do that <laughs> And mine's not wonderful, so um, I'm just kind of winging this. So, <clears throat> um, so there's part of it. Um, I'm just finished the first. I had like four rows of the white done on here, and then I had to frog it all back. Um, so I'm just on this row over here, and then I'm going to finish this length of it over here and then I'll be done the front so um I'm gonna do it in a front panel and a back panel Brianna K seems to be doing it kind of all in one sort of kind of um I didn't actually watch all of Kristen Omdahl's so I don't know how her structure worked but you know, other people are doing panels, of, like different panels. So yeah, um, but I will leave. I'll, I'll leave those links down below. <clears throat> so I'm all I have to do is that part on this side, and then the back panel, and hopefully, it will be finished. It's not overly wide. It's not going to fit me. That's for sure. <clears throat> um, but it will fit my mannequin. And hopefully it will fit somebody that comes around the shop that wants it. So there's that. Then I went to Michael's. I had an appointment, <clears throat> Cairo appointment. God, my hair's a mess. Uh, I had a Cairo appointment after work today. <clears throat> I had to leave a little bit early. I'm sorry, my throat's all groggy like this. The <clears throat> anti-inflammatories that they put me on <clears throat> for my jaw it's drying me out so um i've got raspy throat i don't think i'm going to be taking those pills anymore i don't like the way they make me feel anyway so i have a little time before um hang on one second okay in here i thought my camera was on but it wasn't <laughs> holy cow okay on yes it's on okay so I went to Michael's and I had to pick up this t-shirt for an order that I've been trying to do for the last three weeks, but my decals never came and I was, it's a whole thing, really frustrated and really ticked off. <clears throat> but anyways, the decals excuse me, came today so now I can finish that order, finally. Um, but anyway, I decided I was just going to pop over to the yarn section because I was watching another channel. Oh, I can't remember her name. Her name is Jenna. I'll leave that link down below. She does amigurumi and, or plushies, sorry. Um, and she did a pl cat plushie, the, what does she call them? Stumpies or, anyway, it's a cat. It <laughs> has tiny little legs. Um, and she went and she had eight balls of, blanket yarn and she wanted to see how many she can make out of these eight balls so I thought I want to make one of these cats so I went to Michael's the colors that she has must be on the website because I didn't see them there so I'm gonna to have to go on the website and find out where she got these but anyway so I picked up this one anyway I've had this one before um, and, and I don't have my glasses. Oh, I tell you. Uh, you can if you want to. Don't only hate it up for like 30 seconds. Oh, okay. Um, <clears throat> so this is Ivory Tweed. I love this. This is, I think, what I made my Cruella de Vil sweater out of. If I'm remembering that right. Um, so, yeah. So I got to find out 
These other colors that she got were so nice. But that'll do for now. <laughs> I'm starting to kind of think that I want to start making some, some amigurumi again. But uh, anyways, I went to look at the latte cakes. And holy Hannah. I was talking, a, a lady stopped me in Michael's and she goes, you're Sandy, aren't you? I was like, uh, yeah. She says, I used, I did craft fairs with you. I'm like, oh, I recognize you. Okay, cool. Right. So she started talking to me a little bit. And as we were talking, I says, okay, well, I got an appointment to go to. I got to go. I turned and I looked in the direction of the latte cakes and holy man, I just about fell. Blossom cakes. The Karen Blossom Cakes have new colors. I was just like, what? So I guess Blossom Cakes are going to be st sticking around, which thrills me to bits. <laughs> I just have to say. So this color, I went nuts over. I am going to hoard these things. I swear to God, not at $14.99, mind you. But these are this... Oh. It's tiger all day long. The color is bark. Look at that. Heather, Heather, Heather the Crochet Witch. If you are watching, look. How gorgeous is that? Oh, it's beautiful. I, I grabbed two of them. <laughs> at $14.99 a piece. Oh, breaks my heart, but I had to do it because this color just blew me away. Just blew me away. Look at this. For those of you that don't like earthy colors, you won't like this. But I think it's stunning. Um, and I am totally going to be making something out of that. I'm not sure what yet. <laughs> Maybe I'll make the Taylor Swift thing again and make it with this. Like, make this the accent color. I don't know. But I just, I, I, I went crazy. I was just like, oh, I have to have it. I have to have it. All there is to it. So I'm going to keep an eye out uh, to see. I think, I think these are exclusive to Michael's. I think. So, um, Yeah. But I'll let you know what I make with it. I mean, it's so squishy soft. I just love Blossom Cakes. They are just, oh. And putting this with Latte Cake, hello. Even putting it with the Colorama Halo, hello. Oh my goodness. I mean, I couldn't believe using this. Like this is, this isn't the Blossom Cake. This is the Cloud Cake. The Cloud Cake rips really easily. Oh. see um so that kind of concerns me but i mean for this i'm just like yeah whatever so i used that one um uh, but this doesn't so i'm pretty excited i mean can you imagine hang on oh can you imagine these two these two together like oh the other colors there's a gorgeous pink. It's a darker pink. Angela, my precious Narnery, she would love this color. Absolutely love it. Um, there was some other colors there. I mean, I as soon as I saw this one, I was blind to the other colors, except that pink. I almost got that pink. Um, but yeah, as soon as I saw this, I was done. I was like, oh, mm -mm. I, the other stuff was out of my mind. So... Um, but yeah, I, I'm going to look into the other colors too, because they are really, really pretty. So anyway, all right, I'm going to close out this video and I'm going to go and kick my printer in the, <clears throat> in the ink pads. <laughs> and uh, I got a big order that I need to get done. And if my printer is going to be fussy, I'm going to be very angry. <laughs> So, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, okay. I love you all. Let me know in the comments down below. Are you guys making the Taylor Swift dress? 
And if you are, what are you using? I would love to see pictures in my Facebook page. Um, and uh, yeah, give it, give everybody some inspiration. I will leave the link down below for the pattern and for the tutorial for the people that are doing this. If I can find them again. Um, and uh, yeah, I, don't talk back. <laughs> I will talk to you guys later. I love you all. Okay, bye.